Hello everyone, this is Zach here. Again, just wanted to do a quick update on the overall uh, Bursa market, the KRCI market. So first of all, congratulations for those that who follow counters like Sansuria, uh, IWCT, I think MRCB also doing pretty well. Uh, and some of the other counters that you know continue to break up further. Okay, so of course, I WCT haven't really break up yet to the resistance, but I think the profit that we get also pretty good overall. Okay, I think around like 17 18 percent if you have been following our Telegram channel. Now, this video here, of course, we're going to look for something new. Okay, I cannot promise every time we look for it, uh, it will have some profits, uh, for sure. But uh, let's see what is the age that we have right now in, in, in this market condition. And we try to follow according to our plan now do remember this video here i'm not doing any buy and sell call if you want to do any trades based on you know the stocks that we discuss over here make sure you got your own trading plan right so as usual on my right hand side you you will notice that i have this uh uptrend pullback alerts that usually help me to kind of like um identify what is the potential uh, pullback stocks that i can look into so that you know probably i can keep it into my watches but before that I just want to you know probably look into two counter this is again special request in the uh, telegram groups if you, let's say you're in my telegram uh if you want to uh, look into you know uh, any stocks you just text it over there probably i'll include in my next video here okay so now let's say brand new actually i think the overall setup is pretty good i kind of like how actually it move in the uptrend and it come with a couple of strength with pullback like for example of course this is like a a beginning strength signal before they try to move up further so you got strength over here usually the strength signal will form a very nice support area subsequent goes up pull back strength again goes up pull back strength again and now we got like uh two strengths okay over this area here so it kind of like uh, a bit similar like this area if you ask me but of course there's some problems okay with this chart is that you know this candle here actually come with slightly high volume okay now normally high volume candles especially when the price hits certain resistance or maybe top it will form a strong resistance like for example over here so probably i think it's going to take time for them to cross okay this level here but for me as long as you know my uh this is with my current support i say i kind of like to use my strength signal as my potential support level so let's say they are trading very very close to my support level uh, i don't know later on probably like tomorrow next week uh this is something that i will consider okay providing the the risk remain to be very very low okay so that's quick one for uh rent here so now let's look into wcehb okay another stock that i think got oh okay moving up a little bit already but i think got a lot of potential because this is the setup that we call as a shakeout so what you do is that okay for example this is again obviously it's a reaccumulation stage okay i think it's uh uh I don't know, just got a feeling that it will break up very, very soon. Okay, now, oh, sorry. Okay, so for example, over here, right, you will notice that this is a nice reaccumulation patterns. Okay, nice reaccumulation patterns. And whenever it dip lower, that this uh, support area push it back. So this is what we call the shakeout, which means uh, potentially the smart money may remove certain weekend holder out from the market before they want to try to continue in this uptrend. Now, this volume here definitely is good. Okay, I kind of like this volume whenever they push it back. Now they are trying to test the main resistance. Okay, now of course I haven't entered yet. Uh, I was looking into it because uh, I think like a few days ago, someone mentioned how Telegrams again. So I was watching starting from there. Uh, my alert still over here. This is my alerts. Okay, you can actually use to set in your seafood alerts as well, seafood apps, so it can give you a real time alerts. So, well, this is my area that I feel more comfortable to look for entry, but unfortunately, they hit me the other day, uh, which is yesterday. So, let's see how it goes. Okay, if let's say break out, I will look for the next pullback. If not, I will see whether it can retest around the support areas or not. Okay, overall setup is good, but just that too bad right now, they are very close with resistance. Um, risk to reward is not there anymore for me. Okay, now let's move to the next one okay now let's us focus into this pullback uh, list over here probably i'm going to pick up a few counters from here okay then we see uh, any counters that you know is worth for us to monitor for uh, this week or probably next week okay now i think i posted this out to uh, the members group earlier on this is vs industry okay uh, it actually appeared yeah somewhere around here around 3 15 just now right it appeared again it's kind of similar like um those stocks that you know for example the brand new uh M mrcb it 
moving in a strong trend you notice that lots of lots of strength supporting along the way okay i think just now it also appeared okay the, the strength signal but probably the candle haven't really fixed and formed yet so it disappeared again but uh let's see towards the end of the day but so far i kind of like the volume for today okay again resistance over here hopefully they can cross it successfully okay for uh, vs industry okay now let's go back to my list over here i got maxim coming up was well, the mk land looks like property is coming back right so well this is the one that you know usually the alerts that kind of tell me that which one i should be ready and prepared oh nice one another counter with sign of strength okay i kind of like that okay so here again sound of strength sound of strength above the 20 40 ma usually will help okay so it continue to move up higher with the sound of strength okay so here's another one okay again i cannot promise every time it will break but based on how observation record so far every time the sound strength the success rate is tend to be higher okay or maybe the itch is better compared to without the sound strength okay so mkln okay uh yep something that i think i will watch out okay let me pop my alert slightly higher because i kind of keen right now for mkln of course you can keen in your seafood alert as well okay i'll key in that later on so uh even international Okay, so wow, this one too late, lah. Fifteen percent already. <laughs> okay, so too bad. This is a bit too late. Paramount, okay, EcoVest, Glomac also coming back. Glomac is one of the stocks that uh, I think I do mention somewhere around October, August. But because I focus on that, I tend to forget about it now. This one belum jalan lagi. Okay, I think um, something. Okay, probably this one for me is more low risk. Okay, so previously yes, we got strength signals from here. Okay, but here still haven't seen it yet but i kind of like how they hold very well okay right exactly at the 40 ma okay so again you can watch other property counters okay but it feels like you know they are slowly showing a nice pullback setup okay now lastly before i go i think uh, hatta uh, and, and, and supermax are also making some movement they are coming from uh, the base okay low risk okay over here at least now for me Okay, now, uh, yeah, this will be a resistance. Okay, so this is the initial support. Okay, so probably, uh, you know, it's a good trade to, you know, trade along within the range. Okay, again, not doing any buy call. Okay, please have your own uh, trading plan. Okay, to see whether this one fits or not. Okay, but I think Hata, uh, Supermax, they are showing volume from support. Of course, currently it's up bar. So I think, you know, maybe it's a, a good opportunity to look into uh, the range okay between the support and resistance okay now again do let me know if you got any other questions okay uh especially about pullback if you think that anything that i miss out do comment below so that you know we can cover in the next video